Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, in this video, I am going to show you the changes and improvements in the beta channel of Windows 11 Insider Preview, version 23H2, build 22635.4000. So, without further ado, let's begin. This update includes a small number of improvements and fixes designed to improve the overall experience of the operating system. Microsoft is experimenting with displaying a jump list when you hover over inactive app icons on the taskbar. This update is gradually rolling out for insiders. Microsoft has improved the spelling correction and text editing capabilities, when using voice access. Now you can use these features throughout your voice access session. Improved spelling processing also lets you dictate characters faster, and edit text more flexibly using dictation commands, such as highlight, delete, and navigate text. The widget platform has been updated to improve security and APIs. The changes are primarily targeted at users in the European Economic Area. Microsoft Start Experiences will now support Microsoft Start widgets and feeds. This update will remove some existing widgets and make changes to others, that may temporarily affect their functionality. This update is the foundation for new widgets and functionality, that are in development and will be released soon. There are some fixes in this update like, fixed a leading issue resulting in Action Center freezing or not opening for some insiders in the last few flights. This issue is believed to be causing some insiders to have difficulty adding Bluetooth devices and settings, as the Add a Device dialog would not appear. File Explorer receives some fixes in this update like, issues where narrator wouldn't work correctly when navigating the recent, favorites, and shared tabs for insiders, who have access to the updated File Explorer homepage. Fixed an issue where the context menu in the home and gallery sections would open in the wrong location when using Arabic or Hebrew as the system language. There are some known issues in this update. Microsoft is investigating multiple issues causing an increase in Explorer.exe crashes in recent builds. Insiders in the beta channel who have access to the updated recent, favorites, and shared sections on the File Explorer homepage, may encounter issues such as, files that are shared may not be displayed, if there has been no activity on the file. Keyboard focus may be lost when selecting an unselected tab. The company is working on a fix for an issue where the emoji panel would close, when trying to switch to the symbols or cowmoji sections after selecting an emoji. So, that was it, hope it was useful, consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel and if you have any question, just comment down below, thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.